Let's try film this intro again, seeing as I didn't press record the first time. How's it going guys, it's Thomas on Planet Tech and welcome back to another video. So this last weekend was London Brick Festival and I had such an amazing time. I met some friends for the first time. I also met up with some friends that I've met up with before and it was just really, really cool to have loads of people in the same room that all have a big old love for Lego. Whilst I did meet up with loads of cool people, I know as well that there were some people that couldn't attend. So I thought it'd be cool to compile this video together of all the Lego Star Wars mocks that were on display at London Brick Festival. But before we get started guys, if you haven't already, make sure to click that big red subscribe button as I filmed another two videos that will be coming to the channel very soon from the weekend. One collaboration with Not That Sam Smith and SW Bricks and Figs and a vlog of the two days that I spent up in London too. So it was a ton of fun and you guys will see that in the vlog for sure. Where possible, all the links to the creators of the mocks that you're about to see will be in the description below. So after this video and after you've left a like on this video, go show them some love on their social medias too because these guys displaying made the festival really enjoyable for all of us guys attending. Let's waste no more time and check out some of the mocks at the show. Okay, custom Star Wars stuff. We've got Harrison Dula Brickhead. We've got a 501st Trooper, Incinerator Trooper, they look awesome. Anakin, Obi-Wan, and Yoda. There's just regular ones. We've got the uh, Naboo Starfighter. This looks so cool. This looks sick. And we got, yeah. That's the 2021 time. Yeah, we modded that, that's cool. And then we got some Book of Boba stuff here. Oh, this is, this. so I've actually picked up these helmets, this helmet, uh, so I can't wait to put that on my Boba figure. We've got some small vignettes here as well. Very, very cool. Oh, we got the cab. Oh, this is sick. Very topical. Oh, it's a it's a purist. It looks like. Oh, custom. Yeah, yeah. With a Jawa. Yeah, with a Jawa. It's also that's awesome. We got some uh, some five first battle pack old builds there. This is really cool, man. This is sick. There we go. The helmet as well. Looks really really cool. Oh, awesome stuff. These marks here. Alan Kapuska. I hope I pronounced that right. Hope I've not butchered that, but yeah, even Grogu looks really cool over here as well, so yeah. Over here we have Sam Norman's Rebel Hallway build. This looks really cool. That's awesome. What a shot. <laughs> Love the lights. This is a really, really cool hallway scene from A New Hope. All the one. Yeah. Awesome stuff from Sam Newman. Okay, so we've got Demon Hunter bricks. We've got a load of custom lightsabers. Loads of custom Star Wars blasters as well. I've actually picked up the Darksaber. Couldn't let that slip away. That's awesome. But these are really, really cool. So these are sold as full kits. We've got a price list here as well. Yeah, these are really, really awesome. Very, very well built. And I'm really looking forward to building my uh, my dart saber. That's awesome. Okay, we got some mocks here by Bricktifer on TikTok and Instagram. We got this trench run scene here, which is just greebled so well. I love this. Very very cool. Some really really great uh, greebling techniques here. We got this Jedi mock here as well. Speaking to Chris earlier, and he was saying about how this is kind of a uh, modification of the MIDI scale uh, Star Destroyer over this this Jedi city. I love this technique here with the uh, with the wedge plates. I think that looks really really good as like sediment uh, degrading over time. And then more Star Wars stuff here. We got some really really fantastic mini builds here. Particular favorite the Kylo Ren shuttle because I love Kylo Ren. But yeah, we got X wings. We got shuttles we got falcons snow speeders the u-wing as well love my rogue one stuff but yeah this is really really cool so brick to fur on instagram and tiktok to check out some of this awesome stuff so the next three builds that you're about to see are from a builder called Gecko. Now, unfortunately, I didn't get any shots of the mock at the convention. I did speak to him for a little bit, but when I come around and take all the shots of the Star Wars mocks, uh, he had actually packed them all away. So I got him to send me a few photos and honestly, 
These are some of my favorite mocks. They're prime examples that you don't have to go large scale. It's it, you can ch achieve great things with just the small details because the, the greebling and the, the landscaping on these builds are just so, so cool, super inspiring. And I can't wait to build some of these sizes as well. So Gecko, great job, dude. Um, and it was great to meet you as well. We got a mock here from Ben Bricks. There's the handles, go check them out. Really, really cool channel. Uh, I've been following this mock build series actually, so it's really, really cool to see this in person. I need to stop saying cool. I need to learn some better adjectives to describe some of these stuff. But this is the M5 builds gunship, and he's uh, decaled a load of clones as well. We've got the AATs here, some 212 troopers there, some explosions going off in this little bunker, and the rock work looks really good. Mix of the light blue is great. I love the doors. Yeah, I like them a lot. And the flag there. Just really, really cool. Some trenches. Then you come into the base over as well. Those classic uh, light designs that you see across the uh, the clone and imperial uh, things. <laughs> Why am I freezing up? I don't know. But yeah, we've got Anakin in here, some officers. We've got some uh, commander droids that have infiltrated the base here. Five of first troopers and Chewy. And a little rest there in the what looks to be the medical bay or the, the barracks. And then yeah, we've got some more clones deep in here. Some analysis of a of a commander battle droid as well. Yeah, great mock by Ben. Um, as I was speaking to him earlier, and uh, yeah, he's got some really cool stuff planned. So make sure you go check him out. Here's the handles again. Ben Bricks on YouTube and Ben Bricks underscore ninety nine on uh, on Instagram. So we've got a really small. 16 by 16 it looks like Mando and Grogu mock by George Gillespie and there we go the brain of MRG on uh, on Instagram so go check them out it's awesome if you guys know me you know I love a mosaic and these are really cool one by one brick princess layer and classic layer there as well on the lights there, hard to get that all in, but yeah, I want to do one of this scale soon because that would just be so epic. Love them a lot. Nearly missed this little cutie as well, little BB 8 mosaic 16 by 16. And that's it guys, that is every single LEGO Star Wars mock that was displayed at London Brick Festival this past weekend. Honestly guys, I can't stress enough how much of a good time I had. I met so many people and so many familiar faces. It was great to see Ben's mock that I have been following the build series on as well. Like that was just really, really cool to see that in person. And yeah, just generally all the creators there, they were super friendly, super chatty. I managed to exchange details with a lot of the people displaying at the festival as well. So it was just great to meet loads of new people. This weekend has got me so hyped for more conventions. There's a ton of other LEGO conventions, both here in the UK and abroad that I would like to do this year. So stay tuned on the channel because I will definitely be vlogging those experiences. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss those. Leave a like on this video. And like I said, guys, in the description, go check out these builders because they are super talented and it's gonna be great to see their progress and hopefully see them display at conventions throughout the rest of the year too. That's gonna do it for this video, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.